wordy, but that's not why we're here. We are here so I can beat this game, which is championship on normal. Because I said I would beat all the games on normal. I'll even try and use D Mariner. Because I know he's like better, but I never use him. Welcome to I only ever use Jeter. I don't know the speedrunning strat, I think it's like you hold accelerate and uh and tap break. Yeah, you like cut through the water. I do not know how to take turns with them. a speed run taught me Welcome to Sunset Bay. so this game has a weird aspect you got the black bars at the top and the bottom huh yeah speed rank taught me that you can use Z to accelerate to move I had no clue I always use um, A but when you're speed running yeah no world record oh. whoa I was so low from doing the brake spam that I didn't go over the ramp. Um, I, I could still get the subs. The subs could come in. Oh, come on. Subs could come in while I'm doing this. Yo, look at this gain on these punks. I like the hand fan. Yeah, I should tweet it out. Ah, right, I'll do that after this race. Cause world records are fun, right? Yo, where did this guy go? Oh! <clears throat> All right. I will tweet it out. Get three more sub subs during my wave racing support stream. I will make. Hmm, how long should I? How long should I try for? I'll give it an hour. At least an hour. If I'm like getting really close, I'm probably just gonna keep going. You finished first 
Yeah, I actually tweeted at Gilly Guy because he loves Wave Race. Welcome to. I can't. I can't talk about Wave Race and not, you know, not hit him up. <clears throat> I gotta figure out which stage I have the best chance on. Three, two, one. Like the best chance of getting a world record. I don't know. Oh. A lot of left ones. Oh, no problem. Good. Good. I think someone actually just um, got this world record recently. The uh, the Drake Lake time trial. Man, I love this game. Got good music. Mechanics are good. There's no rubber band effect when you're racing people. It's an honest game. It has its stun mode, which is just cool. You did it! You finished first and got seven. Move on to the next. Welcome to Marine Fortress. Oh yeah! Alright, so I know it's possible to get under the wall. I just don't know how to do it. Jamjar, you would have to give me a lot. So. I would hundred. See, if I were to get a hundred one percent DK sixty four, I would absolutely watch videos on how to do it. I'm not just gonna like go in there like these other games where I'm just like playing it for the first time um, and just like trying to figure it out, you know. But like a crazy collectathon like that, dude. Because if you wanted me to hundred one percent, you would want me to like. Do it legit. I, I don't. I don't think you would want me to just like watch a video or something. Like, because <clears throat> these games, you know, like Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask, these games I haven't played before. Like, I really do have every intention of playing through them without any sort of guide. Couldn't do it. Now I'm not gonna win. Oh well. Pass the scrub. Oh! Way to go! Way to go, indeed. You finished second and got four. Move on to the next round. Wow. Welcome to Port Blue. Of course, I have a world record on in stun mode. <laughs> Not this. Oh, wow. I just missed the button there. That's what I get. See, I tried to make the switch to the button. 
not used to it. Oh, come on, you're the fatty. Yeah, I'm supposed to get knocked off. Got the bad beat, but. My favorite course for racing or for stunt mode? Racing, that's a tough one. Um, it might be the last one. Sunset, no, no, not Sunset. Southern Island, Southern Isle, whatever it's called. Um, because the course like drastically changes each lap as the tide goes out. So I just think it's kind of cool. Um, uh, I also like Twilight City a lot just because there's like some really tight spots you have to go through. It uh, makes it interesting. Move on to the next round. Welcome to Southern Island. Yeah, I like this one for racing. Like, it's pretty simple, but when you play it on, like, Expert, there's a ton of waves, um, and, uh, and like I said, as the tide goes out, like, the whole course, it really changes, um, the pathing is different, you have, you have options, I think that's pretty cool, a, a course for a racing game. They're all lap records because I never feel like that. That screws me up. I'm not used to that. Uh, I usually don't go for that on the race. Because I usually will miss it. See, now I have to like, go under here because it's faster. Um, and then this part of the course, like you have way less room on your left. Uh, going around this buoy and around this turn because the tide went out, but like screws you up. Oh god! Oh, power down. Yeah, like each lap, you really you have to take a different line. And then you try and hug the turn too tight and hit the sand. I already unlocked riding the dolphin. Um, I guess I did it when I, you know, like a year or two ago when I was going for world records. I just did it for like, for no reason. But, um, what is it? I just did it at the very beginning of the stream. Yeah, I was, uh, I was planning on building this. It's hard. Um. Yeah, it sucks. It like super sucks. That that's that's not that's not gonna not hurt for a long time. Welcome to Sunny Beach. Get ready for the first day. Three, two, one. Oh my god, I suck. So, I am uh, I'm not a wave race speedrunner, but uh, I have watched a bunch of them, and I'm familiar with some of the the main people and uh, at least one of the techniques for speedrunning in this game, which is actually to mash the brake button. What that does 
is it allows you to kind of like cut through the waves a little bit. Um, so you, you bounce less when you're going and it, you basically you just take more of a, a straight line. Um, and yeah, it just it lets you go a lot faster, which is kind of a bummer um, because it's, you know, probably a universally hated speedrun tech, mashing a button to move. But it's it's not too bad. Yeah, there's um the probably like the best speedrunner is um I'm like freaking blanking on his name. I feel so bad. But uh this guy Gilly Guide um has uh, some YouTube videos on wave race speedrunning. Dude, I can't believe I'm forgetting this guy's name. He has like almost every single record. Oh crap! Uh, how's the how's the game audio? Up, up, down, or oh come on, or stay the same? I just, I love the music in this game. But I don't need to hear freaking engine sound the whole time, you know? I wonder actually if I can turn down sound effects and leave music up. You know, the fast version of this song is pretty good. Are you guys ready? Oh, can he do it? Sampled uploads up a tiny bit? Okay. Can't hear the music that well. Yeah, music's so good. This is a really early release on Welcome a console to too. This is one of the first games that came out, uh, which a lot of people don't know. Watch the signal. Three, oh, I can't two, move. One. Oh. Uh, yeah, I'll I'll try um, next next circuit. I'll see uh, if I can go into options or something. And uh, turn down effects and turn up music. Oh come on! Uh, also, yeah, you pick um, you pick this character for speedrunning because he uh, I think he has kind of the best stats, like top speed and everything. But uh, his handling sucks, so you gotta get used to that. Um, but also, he's the heaviest, so he can hit the buoys without really uh, having much effect. A lot better than the other characters. Funny enough, like, I played this game just so much growing up, but I never really got that into the races. Uh, we always just did stunt mode. Oh, I remember uh, a friend of mine found out that you could uh, you could do double flips on the ramps. That was like our advanced tech, like nobody else knew that. Turtle butt? I always thought it was like a baboon. Someone uh, commented on the announcer in this game a while ago, they, they were wondering if he also did some other games. Um, I guess there was some other game where it sounded familiar. Alright, so there's a way you can you can dive under this door on the first lap in this stage. Um, but I don't really know how to do it. Let's 
So around around this next turn here. All right. So we go around here, and there's this door, and it ah oh crap. It raises uh, on the next lap, but there's a way that you can dive under it on the first lap uh, if you like hit the right wave and do the right things. It's like one of those things I always mean to look up, and I just never do. Alright, we're just gonna catch this person by the way. Oh no, the board! That stupid plank gets me so, so often. Alright, yeah. I don't like going in here though because it's hard to steer. Oh, okay, there's an expert, there's like extra debris in there. Get out of my way. Not hitting that plank. Damn. Damn. Hydro Thunder? Oh, maybe. Hydro Thunder is pretty good. I, I haven't played it yet for the challenge, but I have played that game. Uh, I mean, that's that's an arcade port? Is that an arcade game? Oh, which path do I have to take? This is another level. There are two paths, depending on uh, what difficulty you're doing. And... The like expert path is really miserable to do with this character just because he can't turn for crap. Oh, but I probably have to do it. Uh, uh. Alright, that was like the best I've ever done it in my life. So, that's cool. Dreamcast, yeah, I know it was on Dreamcast. Now, Hydro Thunder was a uh, part of the 20 game challenge that I did versus Wookie. That was one of the games he picked. So I had to learn how to play it uh, for the challenge. Alright, so I think I can squeeze. Yeah, I can. Oh, Alright. Yeah. I cannot go on the ramp. Right, winning this one would actually be super clutch. Ah, did it too early again. No, 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 no. What are you doing? The deep mariner. Go on. No. So close. Yeah, Hydro Thunder is really good. Uh, I I've said it so many times, but there there are a lot of good racing games on this console. People just only ever talk about Mario Kart and Diddy Kong Racing in F Zero, but like. Mario Kart doesn't even belong in the top three. Definitely not. Three, two, one, no. no, all right. So take away the items, and then Mario Kart's not as bad. The items just drive me crazy. They're so, it's so annoying. Like, this actual strategy in that game is to just hang out in second. Hang out in second or third. Like, that's garbage. So this ramp is in a different place on expert mode. This is so weird, man. I'm just, I'm so used to doing these courses on a different difficulty.
It's like, it's like how people love snowboard kids. And it's like, dude, that game is... It's like, it's okay, but the items are just broken. Diddy Kong Racing, though, right? Those items are like, you know, they're there, but they're nothing like insane. And there's no rubber band with the items in that game. I don't know, I've lost enough Mario Kart races to a second place lightning bolt that I'm pretty over it. Yeah, yeah. Um, oh crap, Josh, there was some game I played... Uh, some racing game I played where um, you you didn't steal items from people if you picked them up. I don't remember what it was. Um, might have been like Arrow Gauge. Ah, I forget. But it was definitely a nice touch. Yeah, like I just played in like a little Mario Kart tournament. And uh, like I won the round robin. Uh, but I should have. I beat like three out of the four people. But I should have beaten the fourth person, but they uh, beat me with second place lightning bolt twice. Like, <laughs> what are you gonna do? It's just so dumb. Oh, and those buoys are switched on expert mode. Wow. Yeah, I never realized how different the courses were. Oh yeah, and then the finals of Mario Kart, I got totally wrecked because uh, I had to play on a West Coast server, 98 ping. <laughs> it was like, it was impossible. Alright, so we're done with hard, now we play expert. Oh, I fell off. Dude, it's not even hitting shortcuts on 90 ping, it's just like, just navigating the levels. Like, you know, you're used to like jump turning and stuff, like imagine your jump turn, like, just doesn't happen right when you push the button, you know? Like playing Bowser's Castle, like I just got wrecked. Or uh yeah, it just sucked. Um, so this was like a really big deal when it came out, the water physics in this game. Like a really big deal. And honestly, like uh no other uh, games weren't able to replicate that for a very long time. Like no one did. <laughs> Yeah, so I'm like, I'm trying to find someone uh, in the Remix Discord that will um, build a stage for me. I'm like, I, I don't have like the ability to do it right now, unless I like taught myself a lot of stuff, which I don't really want to do. But I have like a really cool idea, and I, I want to make a wave race stage. I just, I need someone that, that can... Uh, take direction. <laughs> I hit up Far Cry and he was kind of lukewarm about it. You get to move up to the next class. Yeah, so that's what it says. Challenge the next class. So now you guys actually get to see the difference. Some of the differences. Wait, wait, wait. Select your watercraft, please. Welcome to Sunny Beach. So, alright, so my idea for a level. Get ready for 
you know, the like platforms and everything, it's it, that's whatever. Like, um, that's nothing complicated because it's just, you know, setting the stage and the platforms. Um, to make it a wave race level, I thought it would be fun to have um, water that rises. Um, now, I, for some reason, thought that the water on um, Great Bay in Remix um, actually did something. I didn't realize it was 100% uh, cosmetic. Because my idea was like that the water would change uh, gravity if you were in it. But even still, even if the water is just cosmetic, that's fine. Because um, the other thing that I wanted in the level was uh, the occasional guy on a jet ski that would fly by and hit you like the cars and on it. Like, I can draw the whole thing out. Like, I, I know what I want it to look like and, and all of that. And I think it, with, like, hazards off and movement off and everything, it'll still be a good level. It'll still be an interesting level. Uh, but having the hazards and the movement um, would be pretty cool. Just figured out wind boxes. Ooh. So you could do that with the water, then. Have it, like, blow up. Interesting. Welcome to Sunset Bay. How about the whole the whole jet ski thing, like on it? That's pretty doable, right? Three, two, one, go! See now I just need someone that wants to do it. Because also like oh crap. It'll be a cool stage, but it's also a great excuse to start getting some uh, wave race music in the game. <laughs> there aren't like that many tracks in this game either, so you don't need much. Like, there's like one song I really want. A lot of the songs are just remixes of this one, of like the same track. Kind of like Banjo Kazooie. like riding that way. No. Alright, come on, we gotta we gotta catch this guy. This guy's cruising. We might be able to catch him at the very end by cutting across. Nah, couldn't do it. That's close. Yeah, I know you're like a really busy. You have you have a lot of stuff uh, to do with remix. I just need to find someone that wants to make the stage. Crap, man. Welcome to Drake Lake. Really should have had that win. It screwed it up at the beginning. Dude, I suck at these starts now. Yeah, this part is different. Oh, that that threw me off. Uh, when I, we were just did the hard circuit. Like those buoys are in different places. I was like, wait, why is this so easy? Oh, it's different. Dude, I suck right now. There it is. Look at this line I take.
Oh, yeah. Spread him. You finished first and got seven points. Move on to the next. Yeah, the frog helmet. I know. That's why I like doing the handstand at the end. Fortress. All right, this one, this one's tough. Are you ready? Three, two, one. There we go. Man, that, that is a tough turn right there. You're not messing around. Alright, I'm not sure if I can make the jump on this one. Yeah! Yeah, they were really just showing off with the the water physics on this one. This course. But yeah, like the waves and everything, that was one thing that made stunt mode interesting, because you can do tricks off of the waves. If you like time your inputs right and everything. You get these crazy jumps off of waves. Uh, it's just a great game. You finished first and got to move on to the next. Welcome to Port Blue. All right, this one's gonna be tough. Have a good win. Three, two, one. Back off, idiots. Alright, here we go. Alright, that, yeah. Looks like I've kind of figured out how to not be terrible at that far. Oh, you can't cut the corner there! No! I didn't know! I didn't know! That's why I was so surprised playing the last circuit. Because I'm so used to this one. I'd be pretty happy with the second place here. Since I typically expect last. Crash three. That's cool. Move on to the next. Welcome to Twilight City. Yeah, so you see on this one, this time with that ramp, you don't just jump over the wall because the ramp's uh, closer to you. You actually have to go up the ramp and dive. And I guess all this stunt mode courses 
um, mimic expert because that's what I'm used to. Oh no, the ah, uh, I forgot it's right there. Yeah, I mean, it's not bad. I'll do a flip off the last ramp for you guys. Flipper barrel. Oh my god, this guy's terrible at flips. I forgot. <laughs> He's so bad. He's so bad for stunt mode. Almost didn't make that. Welcome to Glacier Coast. Yeah, this is uh, not the character I use for stunt mode. Oh, I suck. This course is actually, I think, easier on uh, reverse mode. There's just like one turn that's easier, but it makes the whole thing easier. Oh, oh come on. This turn right here, this one, I think is e actually I did that pretty well. Ah. Oh crap! I thought I was done. Hey, never mind. I'm amazing. Why did I ever worry about that turn? Here, I'll just show him the butt. Give him the booty. I need 30 points to advance, guys. Welcome to Southern Island. I need 37. Sweet. I don't even have to finish this race. Maximum power. This song. This is the song I want in a uh, in remix. Yo, ho, CCG, what's up, man? The conductor. The conductor returns. Oh, oh. There we go. How you doing, man?
Dude, come on. You think people are coming to my channel and and starting freaking whatever hype trains? That doesn't happen here. There's no hype. Yo, Cornfan, what's up? You're gonna make your mom play Fall Guys. Damn. Hey, pretty well. I mean, his character, he's, he's very fat. He's, he's quite large. Look at that. Look at that guy. And then, yeah, he has the, the baboon print. Oh, no, what's up, man? I, I remember that now. I'm going to start some life again soon. Oh, so I so I, I lost all my cartridges, but I did find these. You know, thank God, thank God, I didn't lose these. So I still have all my empty, my empty shears, cart shells. I could, obviously I could easily sell those and make all my money back. Alright, so now it's uh, reverse time. You have a shears cart? Nice. Maybe people will take pity on me and I'll be able to sell them for like 10 bucks. Challenge the next class! Yeah, man, even like the one I had from like Funko Land with the 1999 sticker on it. $19.99, not the year. I still remember going in to get that, that copy of the game. I remember when I got it. I walked in and uh, I asked the guy if they had Smash Brothers and he looked at me and laughed and he was like, there's no way. He's like, but you're welcome to look. So I was like, all right. So I looked and they had a copy and he was like, wow, we must have just gotten that. Um, I turned off Burt Redemption because he's not down here right now. As soon as he comes downstairs, I'll turn it off. I'm away. So reverse is actually like the the peop the AI is better than um, expert. So it's not just playing the courses in reverse. It's actually it's also harder. I think I think it might just be like me making that up, but it feels like it. Oof! It's a close one. Yeah, Bert's just upstairs. I have like a couch for him down here. Be like, uh, where is it? A little, his little couch. I mean, you could you could pet me, I guess. You finished work and got move on to the. Oh, wait, actually, CTG, did you see the new the new thing? Welcome to Sunset Bay. The the kill the kill me thing. It's a pretty good. It's a pretty good redemption. It was very popular in my last stream. Probably because it was new. Get out of my way. And yeah, the buoys are in different spots. 
um, in reverse mode also. So, man, that one. That's such a tight turn. Oh, come on. Totally had that. Did that one count it? Alright, I'll take it. I'll stand on it. Dead. Oh, I forgot to change the length of time that it stays up. <laughs> I actually, uh, I'm gonna change that right now. Edit commands. Yeah, let's do 10 seconds. 15 is a long time. There we go. You'll run it back. <laughs> Move on to the next round. See, now that I have all this... <laughs> Welcome to Drake Lake. <laughs> It'd be funny if it also, like, cut my mic. Watch the signal. So I couldn't talk. But that's not really feasible. Since, oh crap! Oh crap! Since I uh, I run all my audio through the mixer, if I cut the mixer, I'd have to cut the game audio, and that just wouldn't be fun. It's just a it's just a silent stream with a skeleton. Oh crap! Yeah, playing reverse is so weird. Oh no! That was rough. Definitely not what I needed on the last lap. Oh, that's bad. They're all right there, too. Dude, frame rate. Whew. That was lucky. I don't think that one should have counted. Yeah, like I'm just I'm not used to racing in this game either. I'm so used to stunt mode that I never have four people on the screen all at the same time. I didn't even realize that happened. That slowdown. Welcome to Marine Fortress. Well yeah, the Chun Li put the, the Chun Li disappears and everything on the shelf disappears. The light, my water bottle that's right here. Because when I first set it up I didn't have any of those things, so I, I need to I need to redo the uh, picture. Oh crap. Oh crap. Yo, hit. Oh. No, the plank guy. Oh my god. That was all the way over there. Better get moving. Oh come on. 
No! Alright, well... Fight for third. We can we can take her. We can beat her. Oh, she just ran me over. No, no. All right, that was it. Damn. Fourth. Okay. Nice try. <laughs> Dude, I started wearing glasses in first grade. So things were blurry my entire life. <laughs> Welcome to Port Blue. But then I got that the eye the eye surgery, the magic. Now I can see. Oh yeah, my, my eyes were like really bad though. So I absolutely needed them. Like, you know, can't read the clock on your nightstand when you wake up kind of bad. Oh my god. Oh yeah, the other one's like right there. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Damn, dude. Dude, that's... Oh, man. This is a hard level. Or blue reverse. Is like... Just evil. No. Oh, it's that one's so hard to get. And third place would be really nice. I can miss one more. Oh, let's go. Yeah, there's a lot of sharp turns, and this guy just he does not make sharp turns. It's definitely it's definitely the hardest level. With this character. Like if I had played as like Jeter, it wouldn't be so bad. Welcome to Twilight City. But then the rest of the circuit would be harder. Yo, Chris, what's up, man? Power baby. Oh yeah, this is. So it's the oh, give it to me! Come on. Oh, he's really close to the wall. Oh, that's that's not good. Like this is this is probably maybe between the third or fifth time that I've played these courses in reverse, like in my life. I did not I did not play this. You're about five seconds ahead. I've like only ever played the courses forward. Oh god. Oh come on. Come 
Oh, Marin, I know you can take hits better than that. Yeah, that turned into a joke. Really, just the beginning of this course in general is. Oh, no, it's right there. Thought maybe I could try something fancy. No, get up! In the booty. The cheesy voice of uh, the announcer. Oh, uh, Scar, what's up, man? Yeah, it sucks. It sucks. Uh, thanks, thanks, Chris. Thanks, Scar. Other than that, you know, things are whatever. Still just like slowly getting the house like in order. I know this, it looks like it's all good right now, but everything outside of the camera shot is bad. Three, two, one. I was thinking that actually, like, decorating a, a stream area, you just put things where you wouldn't normally put them if you were just decorating a room, because they have to be on camera in, like, just the right spot, you know? But if you look, you're like, ah, that's kind of high up on that wall, or that's, that's in a weird spot. Yo, Jeter, get out of here. Wow, that just killed my life. Oh no. Yeah, take it back. This, this, this course is easier. Once you get that one turn down, it's not so bad. Uh-oh. Oh, he fell. I knocked him. I knocked him down. Because I'm a big fatty. No! No, I had it. Oh, come on. Editing's fun? Yeah, I agree. Editing is fun. I can, like, easily just disappear for, like, five hours editing a video. I look up and I'm like, what the hell? It's four in the morning. Welcome to Southern Island. And uh, it's one of those things where it gets more fun the more you learn because you can do more. Oh, well. Oh, crap. It's okay. I cannot do that next time. Yeah, so if the uh, the wave race level, it would be Southern Island. It would be modeled after this uh, course uh, because this is the one that has the uh, like the changing water levels. But yeah, someday. Oh, look at that. First try. You're about four seconds ahead. Dolphin and Will.
Let's go. You finished first and got seven points. Great race. All right, we'll yeah, we'll, we'll call it there. All right, so easy. So 13 minutes goes to an hour and four. All right, now extreme G, 14 minute game, 14.15. Set on Uh, not off the top of my head, so I'd have to I'd have to listen to it again. You are a great wave racer. Yeah, the, you are a great wave racer. That's it. You don't get credits. You just get to put your name in, and that's it. It's hard.